Okay, and I said, then what? Like, well, the party's in your home. He goes, yeah! So I was going as fast as I could, and I stacked it really funky. <laughs> Whoever those in the trucks would be bummed. <laughs> No. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Sixteen cents? Ah. Uh, Wolfongo. Okay, Rodnock. Good job. Where is that sound? here. Listen. Okay, listen. Time, time for power off. You know, which it's not that big a deal. We've done it for, you know, probably 25, 30 restaurants. Um, you know, the extras and the condiments and things of that nature. We just need you to tell us what can go into that product so that we can put the keys on the machine. And if you don't want to have all your drinks on there, then you can just go with, well, the food, she would just write a ticket and send it to hang it up. Or, you know, set it on the counter or whatever temporarily. That's much easier than putting a system in there than having to have us reprogram it again. If, if you need another week to do that, then you just tell them, hey, we're going to start our beer run, uh, you know, a week from Monday. Um, not really. It's, they, they have to all be programmed and, and then you, we have to. We haven't even checked out the other thing. Is we we haven't even checked out the communication side for the, with the other guy, with the computer side of it. So we don't know that that data is even going to go across and work like you want it to work yet. You've got bugs to work out there, probably. Well, that isn't going to be able to be tested until. All the registers are hooked up and in your place, the computer's installed, and, and that testing really needs to be done after the system's installed. Because, I mean, we can test it here, but it doesn't mean it's going to work when we get it out there. Because once we change the program here and put your final program in and do all the changes that you want done, that's when you test it. Normally. So my suggestion at this point would be to put some basic cash registers in there and open with those. Uh, open, you know, run for a few days, see what your menu is going to be like, you know, get a feel for what you're going to do and give us the right information. Let's put this thing in the right way. To start now, you know, if you start out wrong, it generally never gets much better. You never see, you know, the time never comes that everything gets in it and things just don't get done right usually. That's been my experience. I mean, take it for, I'll do whatever you want to do, John. I just, you know, I'm just telling, you know. Right, and uh, if uh, if in fact you're you know you get it close and you're missing a few items, that's not a problem. We just don't want to go in there and, and be missing, you know, all the condiments or, or missing the, you know major. Extra, you know, extra onions, no onions, uh, extra pickles, no pickles, uh, well done, uh, mayonnaise uh, on the side, uh, I mean, you know, it depends on the restaurant. What you doing there, Craig? Six, seven, eight, nine, 
Nine o'clock.